it is very common that a system has variants and those variants are different based on the behavior, not only the structure of the system. So uh, then there is a question, you know, can those separate uh, alternative architectures with different behaviors be compared uh, manually automatically in trade study analysis? And yes, it can, you know, and here in this video, we will show how to do it. It's very straightforward, actually. So let's say we have minimum sample here system with the alternative architectures A, A2, A2 and A1, you know, and uh, we are using generalization. And here we have one type of the behavior, like duration 10 seconds, 20 seconds, and then uh, opaque action to assign duration property to the same time. And then here we have A, B, but it's like five seconds, 10 seconds duration, different duration, as you see. And here is like zero seconds, five seconds. So different, uh, different behaviors, right? And uh, uh, then we could create, you know, like uh, instance table and compare them, you know, and run as alternatives. Uh, so for example, here in the results uh, manual comparison, you see like we are creating instance table showing duration and then we can compare here. So let's say that we have nothing here. So we are creating uh, instance table, taking, uh, I could just take the system model, system model like system here, and then show me the columns like uh, this one and this one. Okay. So then create with parts, one, two, three, choose the part based on the generalization, right? A, A1, A2, and uh, we can simulate this, those variants, but run with behavior. So all the variants will execute, you see, and will get uh, response, what would be the expected duration. So for the simulation, you know, we'll uh, create the simulation config. Here we have those configs. So for the manual, we'll just assign uh, simulation config as the whole instance table. So let's assign it here. And then the result will be also instance table like this. And then also timing property like zero, one second uh, as a step size and unit one second. And now let's run this one and we get result. So we are comparing, you see, like longest 30 seconds is this configuration and A2 is the second one, A1 is the shortest one. So we'll take a look, A1 was the shortest one, five seconds. This was longer and this was longer. So uh, also we could set up automatic trade study analysis. So here we have this model for automatic trade study. So we have trade study context. Uh, and then we have alternatives automatically defined and inherited from the study pattern. Here we say also objective function, which generates the score and then alternatives comes as a subsystems. Then we can run this uh, uh, automatic trace study and uh, we'll get results into this location here. Uh, just run automatic trade study, run. And we get results as you see as the next one. So let's create instance table to see those results. And uh, that comes as trace study context from this uh, location. So we have here, you see like results that the winner is the longest duration, right? If you want to, as always, you know, if you want to reverse, you know, you just put the minus before and then the shortest one will win the, the race, right? So let's run it. You see the, the minus five, you know, that the shortest one, so five. Uh, now you, s you might say, you know, okay, those are very primitive, you know, ch choices here, you know, completely not alternative architectures, but we could have them here, right? Uh, so you can have, you see like, for example, like uh, component uh, one and then uh, component two, component Three, even more, you know, you could have those components used uh, in the same systems, you know, uh, for example, same alternatives, you know, in different ways. So, for example, this one is using those components and they will be like component four. Let's say like this one will use, you know, just like this and uh, this, uh, like a completely alternative and then 
component, but uh, reusing the same existing components, right? So this one and this one. So that's how we can separate, you see, like actual implementation of architectures, you know, from the components definition, which could be like separate thing. And now in those uh, activity diagrams, we could actually show here uh, swim lanes. Let's say let's say usage like that, and then those are components, and then we can drag you know who is doing what, uh, and then uh, even uh, so this one is out of scope you know because it is just duration of the total out of the slim lanes, so we can lay out this one, and uh, here we have you know one type of the flow could have decisions could have also use opaque actions which. Uh, would uh, yeah, read the properties of the each port each block for example you know like you can have like cost and uh, add the values you know roll the values you know apply roll-up patterns for example tools uh, apply roll-up pattern for the cost and then apply the cost at each step you know with some multiplier and that uh, like in another case you know would use different uh, architectures for the same components different architecture and uh, completely different uh, to to capture you know result uh, and then th this place again different architecture and that could be you know like even uh, with other type of behaviors and so on so we don't need to have you know similar solutions for those s subsystems uh, now um, and they could have other dependencies and so now, if you will uh, run this uh, you no know, manual trade study, you know we can check here manual run. See no difference, uh, and if we will run automatic, again the results uh, will be produced. Actually, I run manual. No, choose automatic. Results produced and. Uh, all executors successfully. Each of those behaviors were run separately and uh, because we are just tracking duration, nothing else, you know, we get that value but could get also other values and compare. Check out the trade study videos for that. So we can do alternative behavior execution and uh, what happens is that the uh, behavior is executed completely and the final, uh, you know, values of this configuration is compared to other configuration. 